Okay, for factorization using cross multiplication, you must know there are there are three terms. Okay, let's highlight the three terms. First term I highlight with a uh, green highlighter. The second term I highlight with purple highlighter. Okay, and the uh, third term I highlight with pink highlighter. Okay, next step is to draw three columns. Okay, the first column is the green column, the green for the green term. The second column is for the yellow term. Okay, and the third column is for the purple term. Good. Okay, next I put down the term uh, underneath the lines okay so for the green i have one x squared for yellow i have eight and the purple i have six x so next thing you must know is the operation at each column so for the green column the operation must be multiplied okay for the yellow column must also be multiplied operation multiplication and for the purple column, must be addition operation. Okay, now, how do I get 1x squared? So, the possible, um, the possible multiplication here must be x times x. And then, I will get x squared. Okay, for the yellow column, how do I get 8? Okay, this come to the uh, tricky part. To get 8, I can get by 1 times 8. Okay, or 2 times 4. Okay, if I do 1 times 8 here, I also get 8. Okay, and if I do 2 times 4 here, I will also get 8. Okay, it's okay. Just put down the possibility. And next, let's see uh, 6x. Okay, 6x comes from our cross multiplication between green column and yellow column. Okay, now let's cross multiply them. So, I start with the first x. I cross to 8. So, 8 times x is 8x. And then, I cross multiplication with the second x. With 1. So, I will get 1x. So, if... Okay, now look at the purple column. If I added 8x plus 1x, I will not get 6x, right? Yes. So, 1, 8 is not right for this uh, question. So, I erase 1, 8 here and also here. So, let's multiply the first x with 4. I will get 4x. And let's multiply x with 2. Second x with 2, you get 2x. Good. Okay, let's add 2x plus 4x. Yes, 6x. So, this is the correct choice. Okay, so what is our factorization now? So the factorization is, okay, can you see the uh, the gold bracket here? Okay, good. So this is our factorization actually. How about the operation? Okay, so let's see. 2 here is actually positive 2. 4 here is positive 4. Okay. So, your factorization for this expression is, okay, we write down bracket x positive 2 multiplied with x positive 4. That is our answer. Okay, let's uh, try example 9. Okay, in the textbook, factorize each of the following expressions. A, x squared minus 6x plus 9. So, first, highlight each term. The green, the first term is green. The second term is purple. And the third term is, okay, yellow. 
Good. Okay, next, uh, draw three columns. The first column is for green. The second column is for yellow. Good. And the third column is for... Okay, next, put a straight line there. And we put down the terms for each color. Green color is X squared. Okay. Yellow color is a positive 9. Okay. And the purple column is negative 6X. Okay. We have negative and positive sign here. So, beware. Okay. First, how... Uh, I'll write down the operation. Good. Okay, for the first column is multiplied, second yellow column is multiplied and the purple column is plus. So, how do we get x squared here for the green column? Yes, good. x times x. Simple. Okay, how do we get 9 here? Okay, it can be either 1 times 9 or uh, 3 times 3. Okay, but uh, if we look at the uh, purple uh, term, it is not possible to choose 1 and 9, right? Okay, so I choose 3 times 3. Okay, and then if you can see here, I want to, uh, I want to multiply uh, green and yellow column. So, let's multiply. X times 3 is 3X. Three X. X times 3 is 3X. Three Okay, then I look at the pink, uh, the purple column. If I added 3x plus 3x, I will not get negative 6x. I will get positive 6x. So, I must have negative sign here, right? So, how do I get negative sign here? Good, okay. To get negative sign here means, okay, before I mat multiply green and uh, yellow column, I must put down negative 3 times negative 3. I will get positive 9. Okay, and then I try to multiply. X times negative 3 is negative 3X. And X times negative 3 is negative 3X. Then I added negative 3X plus negative 3X is negative 6. So this is the correct one. So I put break gold bracket here. For our factorization. My factorization for this question is for this expression is x minus 3 times x minus 3. That's it. Okay, let's see example 9b. Okay, same thing. Highlight with green, highlight with purple. And the last term highlight with negative. The first term here must be the variable with the power of 2. Okay. And the second term here, the purple term, is the variable with the power of 1. Okay. You don't see 1 there because anything to the power of 1, we, do, we don't put 1 there. Okay. And then... The third term is number with no variable. Okay. Next, we draw the uh, column. Green. Yellow column. And purple column. Okay. Underline and put the term. Okay. We have M square at the green column. Negative 8 at the uh, yellow column. And negative 2m at the purple column. Okay, next. Multiply, multiply, plus. Okay, how do we get m squared? Good. m times m. How do we get negative 8? Okay. Yes, the possibility to get negative 2 here is when here we, get, we have 4 and 2. Okay. But we have negative at the pink side. So, it must be one of this number is negative. It's okay. Just write down first. So, let's say I have negative 4 times 2 is negative 8. Okay, right. Next, we try to... Okay, now we try to cross multiply them. 
m times negative 4 is negative 4 m. Okay, and m times 2 is 2 m. Okay, then we try to add negative 4 m plus 2 m. Yes, you will get negative 2 m. So this is the right uh right uh, number to put negative. Okay. Let's say uh at your first attempt you put um negative at 2. And then you do the cross multiplication. Let's see what happened. So m times 4 is 4 m m times negative 2 is negative 2 m. So when you uh, you added 4 m add with negative 2 m, you will get 2 m, not negative 2 m. So this is wrong, okay? So negative shouldn't be at 2, but negative should be at 4. Okay? So negative 4 m plus 2 m is negative 2 m. So now you have the answer, the factorization for uh, m squared minus 2 m minus a is okay, m minus 4 times m plus 2.